Hey, this is Pete Hink. We're back out here at Black Point. This is the one year anniversary of seeing what's going on here with the seagrass. So I'm going to get out there. I'm going to put the cameras down and we're going to see what's going on. Well, put the cameras down, and uh, there is a lot of grass at Black Point. One year later, after I put the cameras down, um, not as healthy, thick grass as I'd like to see, but grass. It's all the same thing last year, and then uh, same thing with September. We had a hurricane come through, and uh, just that water discharge from the C-54 canal and the amount of water that came through there just devastated this area and it took months for it to come back. Here's some video of what it looked like a year ago and um, so you get some comparison. And then I'll show you video clips throughout the months when I was able to get back out here and shoot. At first it was pretty bare, and pretty barren. Eventually, we're back to where we were a year ago. So, crucial thing is hurricane season. Now, I think this grass will survive if we get a hurricane, if we just have the normal runoff, the local runoff. I think the grass will survive that. The grass definitely will not survive us dumping all the water from the C-54 canal, and all that water is intended to go to uh, on the St. John's River, up the St. John's River for Jacksonville. So. Um, they say they only have to open that uh, levee once in 100 year storm, and that was last year. So, any hope at all, this will be the year we make a comeback. So, I'll keep putting the cameras down. Till next time, this is Pete Hink, Palm Beach Pete. Thanks for watching.